I'm here in Austria. Tomorrow is the climb of the highest mountain of Austria, the Grosslockner. I feel ready. Um, given myself enough days of rest uh, from the Alpspitze. So anyone who just joins in, in this vlog here, uh, this was a little mountain adventure or a little mountain trip that I made where I actually wanted to climb three mountains, but the Watzmann, so the third mountain, which was actually happening after this, uh, got cancelled because of the weather. It can happen, but I'm gonna climb it in a couple of months then. So that's cool too. Um, but so I climbed before this uh, here, the Alpspitze. Uh, if you want to see the start of this little mountain trip, then in the description of this vlog, you can find the uh, previous vlog of the Alpspitze. I feel pretty good in shape. Uh, it was good to climb the Alpspitze. It was a little warm-up climb. So all my muscles are, yeah, they're ready. <laughs> and uh, also to get used to the altitude, because um, the Grosslockner is about 3,880 meters or something. So once you get above 3,000 meters, then you can get altitude sickness. So that's why it's good to actually sleep in a hut uh, on the mountain and then can chew in the next day because you're acclimatizing. You're equal, I don't know that word, but you're actually making your body get used to the altitudes. Always oh, starting with the snakes. All packed and ready to go. The weather conditions looks, they look amazing. It's just gonna be terribly hot. Uh, like tomorrow it's gonna be a couple of degrees less warm. But today it was like 30, uh, tomorrow it's gonna be 26. But then the day actually of the, the summit day, it's actually gonna go up to 30 again. So it's gonna be a hot day of uh, going up. At least it's clear skies. Uh, the weather looks like it's not gonna stop us from reaching the top, so that's good. <laughs> Super! So, tomorrow at 5 a.m. Um, breakfast is served and basically at 6 we are going up to the top. So uh, yeah, it's now I think like 8 p.m. So I think in three hours most people are off to sleep and I will do that as well. Um, yeah, I mean I got a couple of audiobooks to listen to so I don't think I will sleep uh, at 11 p.m. already, but at least rest my body. It's not a bad thing, but I'm gonna go outside to take a few photos and film a little bit of the stunning view that I'm surrounded with. Also, the sunset is happening soon, so never a bad time to go outside. It is exactly 4.30 a.m. right now. Time to get some breakfast and start uh, scaling the Grosslocker. Let's do it. My watch says I had three hours of sleeping, so that's something. Uh, but I feel okay. feel ready. feel energized to go to the top. So let's get to the top.
Dank je. Heel goed. Hey, goed gedaan hè. Lekker man. Nice gedaan. Oh, ik moet Tess wel even vaststellen. I just came back now from the top. It's 11 o'clock, so um, still got the whole day. But yeah, first things first, I will take a shower because I desperately need a shower. <laughs> oh, the look of this car. Oh, I probably look like a tomato because it's been so warm. For anyone watching this video who was looking for more information about climbing the Grosslochner, I will link in the description of this video some additional information about equipment to take if you want to go with a guide, a good platform uh, to use called Explore Share uh, that I use through this now as well. I can highly recommend it, really cool platform. Uh, and uh, anything else that I think could be helpful for anyone wanting to climb the Grosslochner, I will link down below in the description of this video. <laughs> and I'm just laughing because I'm, whew, I'm sweating. But I hope you all enjoyed this vlog here. That's another highest mountain of uh, a country checked off. A few more to go. <laughs> Let's take a shower. <laughs> Hey.